Hello, this will be the only video on the, the internet on the, how to clean the sensor on the GFX 100S. And by the way, this is the official Fujifilm methodology to cleaning the sensor on the medium format GFX 100S. Now, since it is an expensive $6,000 camera for medium format, it's actually extremely cheap. Um, it's very, very important that you follow these steps. It's actually critically important. Um, not only because it's an expensive camera, but also, too, because it is an IBIS camera. And there's specific steps that you have to follow. There's four, specifically, that I'll go over in this video. On uh, Before you clean the sensor, it's not like you just raise up the mirror on an old DSLR and start cleaning away at the sensor. You have to follow these four steps. And let me go over these. And uh, uh, also, too, an important note, what people don't realize is that when the IBIS is off, it is still on. Since the sensor is actually sitting on an IBIS mechanism with like the battery out, for example, or with the camera off, the actual sensor is free floating on the IBIS mech. So you would not want to clean the sensor like that. Okay, so when the IBIS, when the battery is in and the camera is on and the IBIS is off, the IBIS is still on. What it means is it's holding it in position. Okay, so let's go over these uh, four important steps. But first realize that people would think, well, I'd want to clean uh, the sensor with the IBIS on. No, you do not want to do that because then it's trying to correct for you placing pressure uh, on the pad on the cover glass that's covering the sensor. So with the IBIS off, you're going to be cleaning it with the IBIS mechanism holding the sensor in place. So first steps that we need to go to is we're going to go into shooting settings, page two, and there's two on this particular page. You're going to go to shutter type, and you want to go to electronic shutter. Okay, so turn on electronic shutter. In other words, when you're cleaning the sensor, since it has to be cleaned with the camera on, Somebody could accidentally, while they're focusing on uh, cleaning the sensor, accidentally press the shutter release, and with the mechanical shutter set, then it would completely ruin the mechanical shutter and uh, you know cause an enormous amount of timely, costly damage to your camera. So you have to, have to, have to have the shutter type set to electronic shutter. Secondly, you need to go down to IS mode or image, stabiliz image stabilization mode, which of course is relevant to the IBIS, and you need to turn it off, okay? While the camera is on and the IS mode is set to off, it is the IBIS Mac is holding the sensor in place. This is what you want, okay? So, third step out of four, let's go to our settings menu and our button dial settings, and we're gonna go to shoot without lens, and you need to turn that to off, okay? Turn that to off. In other words, since you're gonna be cleaning the sensor, you can have the lens off of it, you cannot accidentally um, fire the camera with uh, the lens off while you're cleaning the sensor. So that's third step. Fourth number, fourth step is the camera must be on. Okay, so you have to follow these four steps. You don't, once you've done those, you just can't have, and it makes sense. Someone think, well, I'm gonna clean the sensor. I'm gonna turn the camera off. No, the camera has to be on when you're cleaning the sensor. So, but please remember to follow these steps before cleaning your camera. And in doing so, and I'll post a link below on the, uh, I made up a list of the four things that everybody gets wrong on sensor cleaning. It's in a video, follow the link in the description below on then following the correct methodology of doing a normal sensor cleaning. I have at least like about 10 videos on sensor cleaning, but these are the four preliminary necessary steps that you have to follow on cleaning the sensor or on your GFX 100S. And by the way, as I said before in the start of this video, this is the official Fujifilm methodology for cleaning the sensor on the GFX 100 or this specifically the GFX 100S. I'm glad I could help and post this vital information. I could see how somebody would think, well, I'm just going to clean this like I would clean any other camera. I'm going to turn the camera off and I'm going to open it up. And no, 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 no. No, 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 no. You have to follow these steps, okay? Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like these videos, and I'll have the final review uh, later tomorrow. I've been shooting the hell out of uh, this, the GFX 100S, the final review for it. By the way, if you also have a GFX uh, 100S, get this. This is a GB001. It's called a Grip Belt GB uh, Grip Belt 
GB-001. It was made for the Fujifilm X-T1. It's still available for sale, and it fits perfectly on the GFX100S. I think everybody should buy it. I think it's like 34 bucks or something like that. And uh, get it, okay? It's uh, synthetic leather, I believe. But uh, very comfortable. Fits this camera perfectly. And uh, wait for it. Fujifilm.